Hey YouTube, uh, this is a video response to um, a tag by Ginger Greek, although of course everyone watching his um, glorious hippopotamus video uh, will also have been tagged I suppose. Um, and it's on what animal I, I am most like, and you get those cheesy Facebook tests and so forth, they usually come out as a dog or something. But um, the animal sort of that I want to talk about, that I identify with a little bit, and certainly one that I admire a lot, is the wild boar, the pig. Um, the wild pig, the wild boar, is tough. It's a stubborn animal. It's very hardy. It lives from the top of the Southern Alps to Midwestern United States, Scotland, England, Northern Europe, Asia, everywhere. It's hardy as any nails, it, it's tough, um, and long been considered a heraldic animal. Uh, the Anglo-Saxons considered it a totem animal of sorts, uh, certainly a symbol of strength and bravery. Um, it was considered very fine hunting sport for being so brave. Um, I'll certainly attest to it, its value as a quarry, it's also delicious. Um, the pig itself is, a, is the small holder's best friend. In terms of output, you get a lot more meat off a pig than you do off... Um, sorry, you get a lot more piglets off a pig than you do lambs off a ewe or um, calves off a cow. You get... Um, it, it, it's because it's a good breeder, you can get multiple farrowings a year, even. Uh, so, yeah, they're... they're tough critters. Um, damn nasty, some of my hunting friends would say, as they spoil the territory for deer, but um, they kind of hold a place for me. I don't know, they're, they're, they um, are quite fun to watch. Um, thanks to the actions of careless farmers and animal rights activists, uh, wild boar now run native throughout the UK again. Um, or rather, they feral escapees, but they were native and they are again. Which, I don't know, is also something a little like me. Um, and, yeah, you can see them in the wild. Um, I've tracked them down in Thetford. They are a sight to see. So thanks, YouTube. Bye, and oink.